What's up guys, this is Pro Warriors. Valeto has just received a massive 2.2 update which brings a ton of improvements and new features. It improved virtual GL compatibility and performance. It also improved input controls and audio plugins. It updated Mesa Tronip driver and Box64. Now you can install custom wine. They also added more TX wrappers and fix bugs so that you could play games smoothly. Please like and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the bell button. Before we get started, make sure you have enough storage space on your Android device. Now let's dive into the installation process. Head over to the Winlet to download page. I have given the GitHub link in the description where they add new APK and OPB 2.0. Now download the both APK and OPB image files. These files contain the necessary components to install and run Winlet on our Android device. Once you have downloaded the APK and OPB files, install the APK on your Android phone. After installation, run the app and grant the necessary permissions but it will close immediately because it's unable to extract the OPB image. If your phone has Android 10 or below version, use Jet Archiver File Manager. Once you have opened the app, it creates the required folder on your device. Now we have to move the OPB file from the download folder and paste it into the OPB folder. Now launch the WinLetter app again. This time it will automatically detect the OBB image and proceed with the installation accordingly. This app will encourage you to create a container. Now I'm going to show you how to customize the settings by pressing the plus icon which gives you all these properties. At first, give the name of this container. It will help you to identify easily. You can set the resolution under the option of screen resolution. I'm selecting 720. You can go up to 1080p. Of course, your device needs to be capable for that. There are few renderers available under the option of graphics driver. The most recommendable are Tani plus Zing and Virtual GL. The next option is DX Wrapper. In this version, they added new features. You should try the latest one. Enable the APS Show option if you want to see the APS during the gameplay. Here you can set the processor affinity or CPU cores. It will automatically detect and select the cores. If you want to use the maximum resources, you can select all of them. Under the section of GPU, you can select the GPU model. Here are all types of GPU available. I recommend using the GTX 1070Z, which is a popular GPU for gamers. Video memory actually indicates RAM. You can also so customize the RAM on your device at the bottom left corner here you will get box 64 which is also added after the update when everything is set up click on the tick button to create a container now click on the three dots beside the container here you will find a new option storage information then click on play congratulations you have successfully installed and set up WinLetter 2.0 emulator on your Android device. You should download some games like Oblivion, Need for Speed, Fallout, X2 The Thread, etc. After downloading any games or application, you need to place the exe files inside the download folder. Here you can see D drive which is actually your download folder. If you sweep, then the toggle window will appear. Here is a full screen option, which is also a new feature. Now configure the controls using the option input controls. Winletto offers RTS, which is best for gaming, and also virtual touch controls that gives you a complete gaming experience. This emulator is still needs some improvement. I think in future they will improve it. We can run and play PC application on our Android device. If you think this video is useful, please like and subscribe to our channel. No more today. See you in the next video. Take care.